Hey everyone, I'm Eric from Game Shampoo, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to connect your PlayStation Vita to the internet via 3G or Wi-Fi. So, let's go out to the main menu here, and as you can see up in the top, I am already connected, but uh, for those who have a 3G model, touch this network operator button down in the bottom with a little cell tower picture on it. Uh, and it'll bring you up this little menu here. If you haven't connected to 3G yet, uh, you might want to consider this option on the side. Touch that. It'll take you to their website. You get an 8GB memory card, and you get a pretty decent data plan for 55 bucks, And you get a free downloadable game, which is uh, Super Stardust Delta. And that's a really good game. Otherwise, uh, just click Start in the middle. And it'll just come up with a screen. Go to AT&T's website. So, uh, click that. And that'll also come up the first time you start up the system. So, uh, you know, you can do that then too. To connect to the operator's website, you'll need to be disconnected from the network you're now connected to. Do you want to connect? Okay, so I'm connected to Wi-Fi right now. And it wants me to disconnect so I can establish my 3G connection. But I don't need to do that. So, because I already have the 3G. But, if you uh, just go to their website, and then it'll give you three different plans that you can sign up for. And uh, none of them are really huge, but you don't really need a huge plan, necessarily. You know, you get like 256 megabytes a month for like 25, 30 bucks or something like that. And uh, it's a month-by-month -month thing. It's not a contract, which is really good. So, if you don't pay one month, you just don't get it that month. And... So it's, it's pretty flexible, but if you're on a Wi-Fi and 3G system, or you're on a Wi-Fi system, you just scroll down to the second screen, and then you'll see a settings menu with a little toolbox on it, right there. Start up the settings, and you'll see a bunch of modes. Uh, Okay, flight mode being the first one, this one shuts off all 3G and all Wi-Fi capabilities for you. So you can play it on the plane. Uh, but what we want is the third one, the network option. And then it comes up on this. You have uh, you have your Wi-Fi settings, you've got Bluetooth, uh, mobile network, a bunch of stuff. You can do an internet test. So let's go to Wi-Fi. And uh, I'll come up with a list of all the different uh, Wi-Fi connections and all that stuff. So you basically just click which one you want to connect to. It'll take you to a screen where you enter the WEP key. Uh, you enter that key, or if you don't have any security, you can just go straight through. And it'll do a connection test. And then you'll be good to go, basically. Uh, you can do a manual connection test by going to the network menu, and then it's those last two selections down there. And, uh, then you can come down further in the settings to find the location data option. Uh, some games like, um, Mod Nation Racers, I think, will, uh, Use your location to kind of dole out rewards in the game. So in Mod Nation Racers, for example, uh, when you travel to different parts of the world, it will actually give you more experience in the game. So uh, you're going to want to switch location data on in the settings. And uh, note that if you do have a 3G system and you want to cancel the 3G and just use the Wi-Fi, you have to come into the settings menu and manually do that or else it will get angry at you and uh, specifically use 3G so you have to manually toggle that off. Uh, it's a pretty easy process and then once, you, uh, once you're once you connected you'll see up in the top of the screen right there you know, you're connected. Right now I'm connected to Wi-Fi so I've got that but it's also AT&T uh, compatible so AT&T is up there and I would be getting 3G reception right here if I had the 3G turned on right now but I have the Wi-Fi turned on. 
And again, turning on the 3G is just a simple matter of going into the settings menu. Uh, that's it for today. So thanks. Uh, like the video and subscribe, please, and have a good day.